Hello, everyone, and welcome to another episode of Vlogging with Earl. Today's my birthday! Yay! And I am going to show you what everybody has got me for my birthday. My good friend Tyler got me this shirt and got me a nice birthday card. Got me a nice birthday card from Tyler. And so it says... Uh, the, this bear is saying happy birthday. At least I think so. I don't speak bear. <laughs> oh, that's great. Uh, but I do speak tiger. Happy birthday, Tyler. <laughs> I guess he couldn't find a tiger card. So I got me the bear card. <laughs> that's pretty good. I hadn't seen that. I hadn't and really opened the card, but he got me this uh, cool shirt too. So and and some tiger stickers. I don't know where I put the tiger stickers, but but that was cool. So yeah, uh, and then Urban Hub Ministries they got me an Amazon card for my birthday with uh, at the Levewell Center, and with a birthday card, and everybody in the VIP signed it. So that was awesome. Yes, and uh, so that was awesome. So thank you all for that. Also, thank you everyone for posting on facebook happy birthday to me both throughout the month and today keep those coming all my friends i truly am enjoying to see how many of my true friends there are actually posting on facebook today so continue to post on facebook happy birthday messages to me all right going on and moving on i have another birthday card this uh, birthday card here um, somewhere um, yes uh, this is the, the birthday card that they got me and it's cool it's a Star Wars Hallmark it says birthday wishes coming at light speed and then everybody uh, actually signed it as well so that was cool I got a couple of cards from them so that was that was really cool that was also from the VIP club I think that one was last year's and this one was this year but anyway, thank you, and I said to graduate their VIP program this year, so I want to thank you for that. Also, uh, I want to thank my fiance Angel Booze. She actually got me some cool Batman comics for my birthday. So uh, this is the Shadow of the Bat, um, and it basically says, Disturbing, strange, and very unusual shadow falls upon Wayne Manor. So that's kind of cool. Um, and then I have the 10 cent Batman one that she got me, Adventure, um, which was kind of cool. Now, there is the Batman Legends of the Dark Knight uh, part two through four that I have, which that's part two right there. Okay. And that's part three. And this is part four. All right. So what I'm going to ask is if anyone can find part one. I have two, three, and four here. I'm looking for part one. I know that Samurai Comics is in Phoenix. I know that ST Comics and games, you know, Showtime cards and games owned by George, my uncle George, is uh, is is there, um, and so uh, this was done by McDuffie, Seamus, and Green. So if anybody can find me the part one of this in, in anywhere, I would be more and send it to me for my birthday. I would be more than great grateful to all of my Arizona people. And speaking of Arizona people. I want to say that I'm going to use this for my birthday. So I ordered some extra stuff from the MonstersMonsters.org website, right? And that's MonstersMonsters.org. Go to the store and you can order stuff, okay, of what's left and what's in stock. Um, anyway, uh, Ken and Steve already received because, you know, we, we did the Kickstarter with the zero Monster Monsters rules. And I'm supposed to get a limited edition one. But... Uh, Steve Crompton actually sent me with my order, and I'm going to use this as my birthday present since you since you stuck it in there. 
I am the first person other than Ken and Steve to receive the zero edition rules of Monsters Monsters. All right. And I said that earlier. But I'm using this as my birthday gift from Ken and Steve. So thank you very much. Thank you both very much, Ken and Steve, for my birthday gift of the original 1976 Zero Edition Rules of Monsters, Monsters that I started playing at six years old. <laughs> so guess what? Today I'm going back to my childhood, and guess what I'm going to do? I'm going to watch Tom and Jerry Winter Wonderland in classic cartoon and play Monsters, Monsters 1976 edition, and I'm going to pull out my old notebook that I actually have here somewhere. And it has an adventure that I wrote for it in 1976, and I just might even submit that. And yes, I know I've been saying for a long time that I am submitting my my game stuff to Ken St. Andre and Steve Crompton for publishing. Okay, I, I am going to do that. But I've had issues. I've had health issues. I've had other issues, all right? And... A new issue that is coming up is my relationship with my angel boos. I love her to death, but sometimes I have to admit she drives me crazy, and I have to admit I drive her crazy. And not only that, but we even got pet names. Her name is Angel Boos, and Boos is basically French for, like, friend and being drunk on, on a friendship. So I have, So my name is Tiger Boos. And, and so booze means the same thing. So I'm the tiger, she's the angel. Yeah, and so at times we can come together and have a great time. And other times I'm being rah, rah, rah. And she can't take rah, rah, rah. So I'm trying to, to conscientiously stop yelling, calm down. And she even says, Earl, you got to calm down. I can't take this. So just throwing it out there. Anyway, I love... Angel Boos to death. She's she's my fiance. She's my lady, whatever else. And I'm going to have to do a part two because I only have 10 minutes on my phone. And I got to upload part one. So with that, I'm going to do that. But part two is going to be what Jason Youngdale sent me last year. And it will have my... Uh, my old address on it and I never opened it. So we'll see what Jason sent me uh, when I open his gift here in a little bit. Cause he sent it to me last year and I never opened it because I got so, so bad sick and landed in the hospital last year around the time he sent it. So anyway, I uh, am getting ready to go back to school really fast and I'm baking me a birthday cake. I posted that on Facebook that I'm baking me a birthday cake. It's in the oven. I went and got me triple chocolate cake mix and triple chocolate frosting and we'll see how my banking comes out whatever else in part three all right uh well i i may i, I may just do it as a facebook update i don't know i may not do another video but uh what else can i talk about really quick for one minute in in that all right so i had a heart attack and stroke on may 1st okay it really sent me back. I had another one last October with a massive sinus infection. And it set me up for a couple of months. So I've had to push back all of my Zimrala GM Adventure releases. Plus, Ken wanted me to make smaller manuscripts and create GM Adventures. So I had to re-finish what I was doing in creating my Bible for the Tigerian Isles. Now I'm working on the actual GM adventures and trying to get the encounters down. And then I am uh, writing uh, winter ambush paragraphs. So winter ambush paragraphs that Ken could simply use and, 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 and however else. And they just go from one into the other into the other sort of like a winter ambush deal. Of, of different monsters, etc., that he can pick and choose what, what would be appropriate and writing a solo adventure for it. So we're almost to the 10 minute mark. My phone only does 10 minute videos. So I will sign off from part one and upload it. And then I will see you in part two and we'll see what Jason Youngdale sent to us. Have a good day, everyone. Bye.